coffee farmers around the country will have to wait a little bit longer to enjoy the benefits that came with the coffee task force report presented to President Uhuru Kenyatta over a month ago after a section of governors under the Council of Governors, but its implementation through a court order. The governors, according to the Kenya Planters Cooperative Union Chairman William Gatay, want some of the previous laws, for instance the one billion shillings guarantee, to sell coffee retained which he says denies farmers the right to sell their produce to a market of their choice. It was very unfortunate, however, when uh, the farmers, uh, when uh, sorry, the governors then moved to court to frustrate uh, the implementation of the, that report and the, and the subsequent uh, changes in the, uh, or gazettement of regulation, we asked them uh, to be able to consider the fact that this coffee uh, belongs to us. It belongs to us. We want to be exactly the way a maize farmer is, a beans farmer is, a peas farmer is, where they don't have all these uh, unnecessary encumbrances. In a bit to increase production, Ngate says KPCU has signed a deal with Chinese firm CGGC International that has committed $600 million to implement the coffee fatigation model within the next four months. We produce more coffee through this fatigation, litigation, and chemigation, where we have uh, up to 32 kilos per tree, uh, up from the average of today's uh, 2.5 kilos a tree. This will lead uh, farmers to be able to have access to more uh, resources, more wealth. Uh, and to achieve it, we have gotten a Chinese company, an Israeli company, uh, because one company cannot do it alone. Uh, the Chinese company has committed $600 million to be able to do this, and already the engineers on the ground, and we are taking them from farm to farm. Gatai said KPC has so far been able to settle its 1.4 billion shillings debt, all to farmers, accrued during the receivership period, with only 260 million shillings of the debt now remaining. We have a great response to the cash now model because you know farmers uh, were used to waiting for five months to get payment. Today you bring your coffee and you live with money. So you can imagine uh, the kind of response that has solicited. Nicholas Nduati, Business Insights.